the physical attraction between, how do I see the physical? Very, they're very physically attracted to each other. Um, I would say that was slightly, that was probably a difference I noticed um, maybe to other sort of more male female romances, which is predominantly what I've done. I've done a couple of male male romances, but um, in the male female realm, it's uh, there's I would say there's there there are other aspects that are ex that are maybe more prevalent. I don't know. All I would say is this takes place over five days, so there's a time urgency factor. Um, and these guys are very, very attracted to each other. Um, so that element of it, yes, there was a lot of chemistry in um, the bedroom uh, for these two guys. Once they sort of gave in to the idea of doing it, or at least once my character gave in to the idea, because uh, as I mentioned before, he doesn't, he didn't want any distractions. Uh, but the fact that uh, Fitz is only in town for a limited five days, and uh, we'll be going back to America, which isn't just around the corner, uh, kind of convinces him. They spark a lot, which you'll find out from listening to the book outside of that. There's a lot of banter. There's, you know, my character's very sarcastic, which Fitz loves. And I recognize elements of, of the British American scenario um, in reading it and playing it. Um, that they enjoy those differences, those sort of cultural differences or just ways of being with each other, not just accents, but um, temperaments and uh, yeah, just their kind of characters which are born of coming from completely different places, uh, America and uh, London and the UK. So, um, so yeah, so they have a lot going on, but they are very, uh, they very much vibe your question about uh, how do I see the physical attraction between them uh, extremely strong. Um, so yeah, so that's, that's that, check that out.